What's up, YouTube? It's Pierre, man. I'm out here on a service call out here in the lovely city of Santa Clara, California. I'm up here in Northern California. And looky, 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 looky what we have here. Um, I was originally um, dispatched out here because um, a call of water leaking in the store. Um, and this is what I discovered. I popped the panel off and looky, looky. This sucker is completely iced up. Um, that's the compressor running and stuff. I'm about to get ready to turn it off. But uh, as you can see, I took the air filter. This is my air filter. It is completely plugged to the max. Uh, poor little air filter, just a one inch little air filter. How much dirt can he take? And then, you look inside there, that coil is completely jammed with dirt. So there is no airflow at all given across that coil. So therefore, uh, we have this major thing of ice up here. Um, so there's nothing really too much I can do right now to just let this sucker unthaw by just turning the compressor off and just letting the indoor fan motor run um, to circulate some warm air across that coil. Um, my, um, as you can see, my um, condenser coil is actually pretty dirty too. Um, we do a lot of maintenance for this place called Regency Centers. They um, do a lot of property rental for like um, shopping centers and stuff. So, but this is one of the accounts, you know, that we come to. Uh, this is an anytime fitness, it's a gym. Um, I need to be coming here, I'm a little bit over, quite a bit overweight. So, but anyways, they have this system here and another little system here. Uh, I believe this is a carrier system. Yeah, this is a carrier. Is it a carrier? Uh, maybe not. Maybe it is a day and night. Let me see right quick. Let me see. What is this? I'm not sure, you guys. What kind of system is this? Not really telling me that much. Oh, okay. There we go. This is a day and night. You know? So, um... This is a PHD336. It is a three ton unit here. Um, factory charge is 410A. This is a three ton unit. And um, yeah, so just a lack of maintenance, man, on you know this system here. It's just really sad. You know, I'm gonna check that. Um, Round cap there, that's for my compressor and fan, I'm gonna check that. And um, just uh, really nothing I can do is just let this coil unthaw. And then I'll be back uh, maybe tomorrow or the next day to clean the, clean the crap out that coil and put another filter in there. So, um, I mean, that's pretty much about it. I'm looking, from the lookings, I think I am gonna replace that cap because it's pretty rusted at the top. I know that doesn't really mean anything, but I want it to look nice, you know, so I'm going to replace that, that run cap. It's a 45 slash 5, as you can see right there, 45 slash 5. I'm going to replace that cap and um, hook up my gauges and pressures and stuff. And yeah, but other than that, man, that's it for this one. Um, once I get that filter changed and that evaporator coil clean, my condenser coil clean, you know, we should be back up and running pretty good. Um, so yeah, alright man, I'll catch you guys on the next one, and stay frosty.